Hey peeps, how are you today? Welcome back to the East Corner. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and notification bell. And make sure you turn that red button gray because the tea is so hot, y'all. It is spilling. We're spilling some hot tea. And if you do not keep up with the latest videos or if we do not post a video right away, we're also discussing the topic on these Corner. So make sure you follow me on these Corner on Twitter and getting all the tea. And also make sure you have your input ready because we're ready to talk. If you leave a comment on my post and my page, you will get a shout out of the day. So Halle Bailey posted a live video and said, What else do we got? Y'all needs to behave. All right. All I'm saying is this, because I'm looking at these questions. Um, what's your guys? Yeah, I'm wondering why does she say y'all need to behave? She's telling people y'all need to behave because fans of DDG is telling her, you know, saying like at DDG, 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 DDG in the comments. Now we know that's his girl. But can she at least get one lie just to be without all of that? Like, we get that you guys love them together. But sometimes, like, can we just get one lie with her being herself? She's saying some of the questions could be, like, too much to where she just don't want to ask. And definitely don't want to wind up being all over the shade room. And, you know, tea pages. That's why they're trying to keep everything private. Every lie she does, DDG do not have to come on there. But if he do come on there, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna you know talk about it. But every live, don't act you know DDG in her live all the time. Maybe she feel like that's that's kind of like annoying at one point. Maybe I just want to talk straight updates about herself in general, not just you know her relationship. She kind of want to just keep it like hush hush. You know it ain't hush hush, but some things everything should not be like you know. <laughs> Every time she do something, DDG said this, DDG did that, we get it. But, yeah, I'm still for Team DDG, but I ain't like that. Like, y'all, woo. Okay, that's probably what she meant by that. But, yeah, so Hallie doing it up. She gave us an update. And so, on our next topic in this video, oh, also, she also had, before we get any further, now, I was on her Twitter page, you guys, and she tweeted out some things. I think the fans of Hallie is still not wrapping around the fact that she's dating the rapper DDG. Now, a lot of the fans are not really, like, on the same page yet. They're, I mean, this one had to really grow on me because in the beginning, I was not for it. But now I think, you know, it's humbling DDG a little bit more to date a girl, you know, like Hallie. You know, Hallie's that calm, cool, laid back, you know female she's not like shaking and twerking it all day long doing all that no went on twitter and twitter out the following love is so beautiful love is beautiful i mean if you got somebody you got all the love and they love you it's very beautiful but she tweeted out and she said love is so beautiful i guess ddg is like you know doing this thing doing this thing someone replied and said ddg and said can you at least let us know if you loved our girl Hallie, before you leave, so we can know it was real in case she don't make it back. And I don't know what she mean about all that, but she has some questions. What you think about that question in the comment section below? Like, do y'all think he really loved Hallie? Like, do you think he really, really loved Hallie? Now, I don't know if he was at, at her, but I saw on Twitter, and he said the following, keep your advice, I ain't want it, clown. So, I guess whoever advice he tried to, somebody tried to receive give ddg some advice and they said he said he don't want it keep your own stuff because he don't congratulations want it. to Aaliyah j we have spoke about her on our channel before she is on the sheen and magazine cover now she said she's slaying y'all <laughs> no doubt of her because she's slaying but congratulations we have spoke about her before in these corner chat and let's get on to too easy looks like too easy has some things to say now i did watch the video when he posted the reason why i'm still in france missing my girls the video was about him and via's daughters him and via's daughters when they were a lot smaller because i think Ailey, the youngest one i think that's her name isla i think isla is it i think she's about one now Sweezy actually also went on his story and let us know this. The truth won't set you free and you don't and you know that. 
why she keep getting my video took down and turn on your comments on your last video i probably do that do the same thing if i lied in court and still lost so based off alleged what tizzy is saying accusations that via was making she basically did not win her case and he won and so the next slide says this by the way that text was a couple of months after she capped y'all down and it's crazy because i knew she was being petty but still did the reach thing and still complied bleep was so hard so he's basically saying hey, i'm trying to do what they asked me to do and also what she asked him to do but it seems like Vaya is still so standing back and how bleep doing didn't see her in court with you oh that's right she didn't want to come in live for you so apparently people are on each other's sides here one person didn't want to come to this case and say all these things to try to make her look good that's what he's saying and then here are the text messages you guys i'm gonna let music play and i'm gonna allow y'all to read them so y'all can stop them here and there but i'm just gonna let y'all read them and see how they go Oh, y'all this is getting very very messy i thought value would be different but i don't know i i just feel like i'm seeing you know a little bit more like why have she went gone through two marriages you know two marriages that's a lot here's tweezy's i thought you had stopped to do youtubers crazy how i'm seeing youtube videos by his world two marriages two divorces Two kids. <laughs> Quit playing with me, bro. No cap. You will pay the piper, bro. No cap. That's all I'm going to say, bro. That's all I'm going to say. Quit playing with me, bro. You dug this hole, bro. My mom always say, bro, you dig somebody great, bro. Did one for yourself. And that's me, bro. I'm going to tell the truth and nothing but the truth. So help me God, please. And you know that. So you can cap all you want, but I got the truth, bro. The truth will not set you free. Truth gonna put, get you put up somewhere, bro. No cap. No cap. Bro, no, bro. No, bro. Fuse, what's going on, man? What's up with y'all? Bro, it's crazy, bro. Everybody say, bro, no, bro. I'm speaking my mind because it's I can do that. You know what I'm saying? And I haven't seen my kids yet, still, and I've been so nice. I went to court, bro. I didn't even go to court for custody. I didn't go to court for the divorce, bro. I went to court because this girl said I'm beating on the kids, bro. She had no proof. Where your pictures at? Where your video? You gonna go run alive and cry and say all this. But, bro, you got all these receipts. Where your marks at? I done choked you. I said I wanted to murder you. I sent threats to you, bro. Everybody in here know that's not me, bro. They know that, bro. So it's like, bro, where are your receipts? You lost. You're supposed to let me see my kids, bro. You're still not complying, bro. So this post is from Vice Message. Don't get fooled by everything this man says. There is a judge decision against him and multiple police cases up open about some stuff that he did. Now, I don't know, like, I don't know how to look at Tweezy or Vaya, but y'all. Then she says says that um there is a judge decision against him about because okay so this I just read that and then I'm like wow like I was going through these little stories and I'm like dang is it that that deep but like what is it to, that's keeping you from allowing well what is it that's keeping him from the kids yeah I don't condone what he's done but keeping them unless he's really really physically hurting them yeah keep them away but 
if you don't have the receipts, if you don't have anything, you know, necessary, or you're just saying that just to be saying that, then don't keep your kids away from a father who does good by them. Um, yeah. And this post said, just don't be stupid. Everything is not for the internet. I protect my girls and I completely love and respect the court decision. I hate that he's still in France, not seeing his girls though. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy and don't forget to hit the notification bell, like, and subscribe button. And I gotta go and I'll charge you soon.